on the channel. It's the return of the Kyle Peterson Top 5, and I figured today was the perfect time for Hacksaw Jim Duggan. Welcome everyone, Kyle here, and welcome back to the channel for another edition of the Kyle Peterson Top 5, a Thursday tradition here on the channel, as every Thursday we're doing a countdown of some sort, and today I figured it was the perfect time of year to do this one. Who are we talking about? Well, we're talking about Hacksaw Jim Duggan. We're doing the Top 5 Hacksaw Jim Duggan figures of all time, as voted by me. Remember, this is my list, and as I always say, make sure you put yours in the comments down below, but I figured it was a great time with Independence Day July 4th right around the corner arguably the most patriotic wrestler of all time hacksaw jim duggan so he goes well i think for the time frame we're in right now in 2022 as i'm filming this one and hacksaw no stranger to toy lines he goes all the way back to the ljn days all the way to current run with mattel so it's very a uh, lot of figures from jim duggan over the years not as many as you'd imagine there to be and i think he is due for maybe a more modern day elite we got one not too long ago two years ago something like that but i think there's that original hacksaw jim duggan legends figure that i would think a lot of people would like to see ran back maybe updated pinless joints you guys know the whole drill right there but hacksaw a lot of good figures of course we're going to start it at number five work our way to number one as i said earlier make sure you put your list in the comments down below and remember this is my list this is my list you put yours down below like i said so without further ado let's get after it let's take a look at the top five hacksaw jim duggan figures of all time all right, we kick off the top five Hacksaw Jim Duggan figures of all time, of course, at number five. And number five comes from arguably my favorite toy line of all time, Jack's Classic Superstars. We're throwing it all the way back to Series 4 when we got Hacksaw Jim Duggan. And I will say, I'm a little shocked we never got multiple Hacksaws in the Classic Superstars line. I would have thought as much as Jax loves some repaints, maybe a black... Uh, Black Tights Hacksaw would have been in the cards, but it never did happen. But of course, we got Hacksaw in uh, Series 4, and I always say this is a good Hacksaw. A lot of people do not like this Hacksaw, and teach their own, as we always say. That's why it's my list. But for 5 here, I really do enjoy this one. I thought it looked good. Yes, the 2x4 is a little bit big. You can't even hold it, of course. Uh, but if you pop this head off, and that's always the rule of thumb for me, if you pop the head off, can I tell who it is? I can definitely tell this is Hacksaw Jim Duggan. Now, Hacksaw, a bit plain, a bit bland in most of his figures. It's understandable. He was basically a 2x4 and blue tights most of the time. Uh, but still a really good figure. One that we got early in the Classic Superstars. And like I said, I'm shocked we never got in a 2-pack, a 3-pack, something. Another way to get Hacksaw out to market. Put him in the black tights like he used to wear, like his old LJN figure, for example. I think there's more they could have done in the Jack's Classic Superstars line. It would have been very easy for them to do that with Hacksaw. But as it sits, Series 4 coming in at number 5 for me. All right, we continue on with the Hacksaw Countdown. And for number four, we throw it all the way back to Mattel. We throw it all the way back to Legend Series 3, Hacksaw Jim Duggan. Of course, this one came with a 2x4 and flag. Very, very similar to the Hacksaw we just talked about. And you're gonna that's going to be a reappearing theme throughout this countdown. Uh, but this is our first Mattel version of Hacksaw. And like I think I said a little earlier, is Hacksaw uh, very underrepresented by Mattel, I feel. I know there's not a ton of meat on the bone with a lot of changes you can do. But I still feel there's a few more Hacksaws to get. And this is a perfect candidate for the Mattel Greatest Hits line, maybe even the Legends line, to run this one back. Maybe you change the head sculpt up. You give it the pinless joints, the double joints things like that I think there's a lot you could do with Hacksaw and I gotta think Hacksaw would sell he is an all-time favorite for many people it's been a long time since he has been on the main release from Mattel we had a GameStop exclusive was the last Mattel from him uh, but still a very good figure all these years later of course the 2x4 always cool to get the flag with a figure that they used with Hacksaw again they used it with John Cena Ultimate Warrior we've seen it a few times gotta get the most out of your flag mold as we know uh, but this Hacksaw really good he's got kind of that reddish brown wavy flowing hair uh, bulked up not as big as you know some of like the warlords of the world but it does fit Hacksaw this mold I think for the body of course the iconic blue trunks tights uh, trunks tights trunks trunks uh, knee pads boots eh, what's there more you want out of hacksaw this is a good plain jane everyday working man's hacksaw jim duggan and this one comes in at number four 
on my top five list. All right, we're at the halfway point. We're at the number three Hacksaw Jim Duggan figure of all time as voted by me. And remember to put your list in the comments down below and make sure you do put them in order. But number three, I can see being number one on many a Hacksaw list. Uh, there's one thing that holds it back just a hair for me, but this is still a very cool figure. What am I talking about? We're talking about RetroFest GameStop exclusive Hacksaw Jim Duggan. And this is an interesting one. This is theoretically a three-in-one Hacksaw Jim Duggan figure. Uh, there's really three figures in one here, which I think is extremely cool to do. And I got three of them right here. Now, when I say three-in-one, it could be four-in-one if you want a min on box set. As you guys know, I have a RetroFest min on box collection, so we got that one. But then you got the plain Jane. You take all the bells and whistles. You take the shirt off him. Uh, you got Hacksaw, very iconic to his second Hasbro release. You get the American flag. You get the American flag kind of gear going on. Uh, as we said, very patriotic with Hacksaw Jim Duggan. So we got that version. But he also comes with a soft, good shirt. So you can put that version on and have more of a middle-of-the-road Hacksaw Jim Duggan. One step further, you can get another Hacksaw Jim Duggan out of this one. As you can get King Duggan. As we know, he did come, of course, with a crown here to represent his time as King. As we all remember fondly. His closest thing to a title reign, really, in uh, the WWE. But you could make King Hacksaw Jim Duggan. So there's a lot to do with this. A very, very cool pickup and like I said I could see this being at the top of a lot of people's lists for me the thing I don't like about this one is the head sculpt the head scan on here I don't like the tongue hanging out it just looks really goofy I know what they're trying to go for here uh, because obviously Hacksaw was always giving him the old tough guy with the tongue out the side of his mouth so he did do that an awful lot in his promos an awful lot in the ring but it just looks a little strange here for me I would have rather seen something more like this this stern tough guy look uh, from Hacksaw Jim Duggan but so that being said still a fabulous figure one I do recommend everybody to have is it is an awesome Hacksaw especially with all the soft goods uh, the flag of course the uh, two by four and then just a different representation instead of the old blue plain trunks there's a lot of different stuff here for me the head sculpt holds it back but it still comes in at number three all right, we're at the final two. It's time to talk about the number two Hacksaw Jim Duggan. And I have to think a lot of longtime collectors have owned this at one time or another in their life. What are we talking about? We're throwing it all the way back to Series 2 Hasbro, Hacksaw Jim Duggan. Very, very iconic Hacksaw Jim Duggan. I would say for someone like me that's been around a long time, when I close my eyes and I think of Hacksaw Jim Duggan figures, this is right up there at the top of the list. Hence it being number two on my list. Uh, but very, very iconic going back to my playing days. Uh, the 2x4, a beautiful accessory. It has to come with Hacksaw. You could not release this figure without the 2x4. So he gets that. He's got good playability to him. Good size to him. Now in my modern uh, fig feds or fig feds of old back in the day I should say uh, he wasn't winning any title belts just like the WWF back in the day but he was a nice gatekeeper he was wrestling he was in the mid card he was there every day on every card for me he was in the Royal Rumbles he was in things like that he wasn't ascending to the ultimate warrior levels or maybe Macho Man and Hulk Hogan levels uh, but he was there he was respectable he was in the fight for sure uh, just a beautiful hacksaw and of course we did get a later hacksaw a repaint of this one uh, added his singlet and things like that not as iconic for me uh, that came with the flag uh, it's nice it's cool it's in there it would be in my hacksaw top 10 but it's not in my top five spoiler alert this is the hasbro hacksaw jim duggan for me and probably a lot of other people uh, because this was the first one uh, during the prime of the hasbro days for sure so for me series two hasbro hacksaw jim duggan all right, the time has come. We're up to the number one spot on my top five Hacksaw Jim Duggan figures of all time. Just a reminder out there, make sure you put your list and put it in the comments down below. And then if this is your first time on the channel here, we got countdowns every Thursday. We got a million videos on the channel. So make sure you subscribe to the channel. Hit up the old notification bell. You don't want to miss a video. Of course, thumbs up this video. You made it this far, you might as well. And then also check out the Patreon where you can get this video much earlier. You can get bonus content, exclusive content, giveaways and of course you get to support the channel best of all but now it's time to get into it it's time to get into the number one hacksaw figure of all time this might be a surprise this might be a sleeper to some uh but this one is amazing this one you know if you know what i like in my wrestling figures you knew i was all over this from the word go and this is a very very rare time on these countdown lists that a basic comes in at number one what am i talking about i'm talking about basic SummerSlam edition hacksaw jim duggan wow i love this one and you guys know why 
face paint. I'm a sucker for face paint. Have been my entire life watching wrestling. How cool do you think little Kyle thought it was when one of his all-time favorites, Demolition, teamed up with Hacksaw Jim Duggan and Hacksaw adopted the face paint? Oh boy. Sign me up all day long. I think he should have just kept the face paint his entire run of his career after that. I don't know. Maybe I'm in the minority there. But very, very cool Hacksaw. Being a basic, you don't have all the bells and whistles, but this is a time when basics were much closer to the elite scale or elite levels of collectability and even uh, posability, I guess we'll say. Uh, one thing I talked about, that Retro Fest Hacksaw, when you're army building those guys, you can uh, steal a, a 2x4 out. So I always I stole a 2x4 to give to this one, so this one still has a 2x4 as well. But very awesome. A lot like that Legends one we talked about earlier on in the list, uh, but the face paint really taking it to another level. Of course, like I said, second secondary good from the Retro Fest for the 2x4, but man, I love this thing all day long. I'd be okay with an elite version of this. Give us the updated articulation, the pinless joints and all. I know there's not a lot to it besides the face paint, but still very, very cool. And like I said, I'm a sucker for face paint. So if you guys know me, you probably assumed maybe this one would be number one, but I gotta think it's a sleeper. And it's a figure not a ton of people really know about or talk about in this day and age. And that's a crime. We should be uh, celebrating wrestlers in face paint a little bit more often, but there it is, this Hacksaw, the basic SummerSlam edition from Mattel comes in at number one. Remind you guys, make sure you put your comments down below with your list. And then while you're here, you might as well follow me on social media as well. Sir Paul 64 on Twitter, Instagram, the underscore Kyle underscore Peterson. And of course, ProWrestlingTees.com. Pick up a t-shirt, support the channel. So for the top five Hacksaw Jim Duggan figures of all time, happy 4th of July. I'm Kyle. And I will see you guys all real soon.